it's about that time. Laughing at you because I barely even took my it's Friday, May 28th, and it's my day off. And it's freaking nice outside. And I hope you guys could hear me because I got my windows down. You know, what do you call this? If you are thinking of starting a YouTube channel, I highly recommend it. You do meet a lot of awesome people. Don't worry about the subs, comments, likes, or even dislikes. Just go on YouTube and have some fun because all that stuff it's gonna fall into place and for me I even like the dislikes more because it motivates me to do better and like the saying goes if they're not hating you're not doing nothing right that's just me but enough of me talking to start this up all right Let's see what they got for Marvel Legends. And they did take out the Super Villains Wave because it was street dated. But you know what? It's all good. They just got the Shang-Chi Wave and uh Modoc. And here's a few of the Kenner three and three quarter figs. And just Ghostbusters and Nojo's for bots. Hot rod. Here's an air razor. That dude. That dude. And a RC. For multiverse. Nothing really. Just your usual suspects. Alright, for Mo2, we just got He Man. And. Oh, the Balcats right there. There's two of them. Here's a Panther. And this is new. It's a four pack of the new Space Jam figs. They're really stacked. It's pretty cool to see. Nothing for Black Series and for Elites. They just got Cena, got a Nikolai, Barbie's Brain. And that's it. For the anime section, how you can. And some kits. And shout out to my bro, the Funko Cop. He's the reason why I got into Gundam and building kits. Here's the Hot Wheels section, and it looks like someone went through because they have the pegs leaning to the side and like what I said before I'm looking for the Razor's Crest but it's not here it's all good let's see what else we can find this is from the movie Taxi there's a post office Charlie's Angel, Terminator, Mod Squad. Brady Bunch. And these little um, micro machines, they would be pretty dope for. And these as well, they would be pretty dope for IO. There's a few more. Here's a 18. Mm, looks like that'll be it. Oh yeah, for my feet heat. What am I for? Columbia 11s. Shout out to Plastic Addict. All right, we're at Walmart. And nothing for Joe's. And let's see what else we can find. There's Frogman and he's on transfer for $14.90. There's Professor X. And 
just looking at the aisle. Really nothing. We do have some of these vintage. There's the, what's this place? The well guard. That's about it. There's Air Razor. And this pretty stack with bots. There's Cheetor. There's a random. Oh. First time, I can't even get him off the peg. First time seeing the gold label flash. Well, anything gold label at a Walmart. Pretty dope to see. And that'll be it. And let me just put eggs back. And there is a tougher. And that's about it. There's Motu's, just Skeletor and He-Man, and the Sky Sleds on Clash War 20. Oh, I forgot the elites are here. They just got Drew, Dusty, Edge, Sasha Banks, and a few basics. All right, we're at Walgreens, and let's see what they got. Nothing for cars, just Magic Gathering. I believe there's a football mystery pack. Nothing for Pops. And nothing so soon. But you know what? It's all good. Alright, I'm here at Walgreens. Golly. Truck. That, that truck is loud as crap. But what do you call this? I'm here at Walgreens number two. And this is the Walgreens that I found with and uh what's that dude's name? The Red Ninja and I'm not even gonna cut it, I'm just gonna keep it rolling. And hopefully this Walgreens give us luck. I like the other one as you guys saw. And hopefully they do got something. If not, it's all good. But this is what they got. This is some baseball cards. Video. Pops. I don't know a lot. And the face. I'm sure if you guys can see it, but this likes a bliss and what do you call that? Uh thank you lunch. I got a ton of broccoli. I have no idea what this is. That's about it. Mm. Here's a few of my little, but if I see anything, I'll let you guys know. And there's a crap load of Pokemon. Not my lane. Oh, that'll be it. All right. The only thing I picked up from today's hunt is WWE Elite Sasha Banks from Series 83. There's a side. Other side. There's her bio. And the rest of the way. And I'm sending to the side. And I'm gonna try my best to do the unboxing and showcase for you guys real quick. And I see if it's in frame. What do you call this? I can't remember when's the last time I bought an Elite. 
Just looking at the collection, last thing I picked up. Mm, crap, I forgot. But let me just shut up and do the unboxing for you guys real quick. Here's the backdrop. And there's Sasha Banks with all their accessories that she comes with. And there goes her set of hands and rings. And let me try to find. Oh, there you go. There's the other hand. She also comes with glasses. Thanks. Let me just fix her real quick. Let me just take a look at the accessories she comes with. And she does come with her rings. And I'm just gonna show one. Oops. It says boss. Mm, he does got Trying to do the showcase to the side. It's kind of difficult, but there's an extra set of hands. And there's her glasses. And it says boss as well. And if you want to try my best to give you guys a showcase, but if you want to, you could count the her jacket as an accessory and on the back it says legit boss. On the back of her trunk says Sasha Banks. Legit boss, and it's not focusing. Hold on, there you go. And Mattel, they've been doing really good. Well, I can't speak properly because I'm trying to focus at the same time and talk. I'm not sure if I'm making sense, but, anyways, Mattel, they've been doing a great job with their. Face sculpt, as you can see, looks like looks exactly like Sasha Banks. And let me just take her jacket out real quick for you guys. And her jacket is pliable. And, um, you know what? I'm gonna cut this part of the video and take her jacket out. Okay. All right, I got the jacket out of Sasha Banks and. It took quite a while, kinda, probably like a minute or two, but her sleeves of her jacket, it is separate, there you go, as you can see, and here's a close look at her jacket, very detailed. And I was thinking of leaving the jacket, but it's just gonna hinder the articulation. And if you guys collect Leeds or any Mattel, you know the articulation of a figure isn't the best, but their face, the face sculpt makes up for it. As you guys can tell if it's gonna focus. There you go. And this was just a quick unboxing and showcase of Sasha Banks. And I don't think I'm gonna ever do a unboxing and showcase like this. It is kind of difficult if you are sitting up 
on the side. But, um, what do you call this? I'm gonna cut this part of the video and give you guys a closer look or a better look of my Elite collection. And I did change my Marvel Legends, the comic book version. And, yeah, all right. All right, here's a quick pan of my WWE Elite collection. And I'll start here. Here's Eddie Guerrero, one of my favorites. The Rock. And I do have more in the collection. It's just some of them, they're in bins because they're no longer with WWE. There's Natalia, Mandy Rose. I definitely need to pick up the new Alexa Bliss. The new one has a better face sculpt. Miz. And probably my favorite in the collection would be Xavier Woods. It's dope that Mattel added the up, up, down, down championship belt and I have no idea why my phone isn't focusing correctly. And I got Sasha Banks besides Bailey, and not Bailey, uh, what's her name? Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair. And I do need to pick up Bailey so I could put all four of them together, but there's a overview shot of the collection. And I'm gonna cut this part of the video again and show you my updated Marvel Legends shelf. All right. Now here's a quick pan of my Marvel Legends that are on display. As you can see, I had taken most of them down because it was too cluttered and it didn't look right. And I apologize for the bad lighting. Even though I got light ring, it still doesn't help. I'll start here with the Street Defenders. I definitely need more stands for some legends like Daredevil. There's Ghost Rider on his bike. Deadpool just chilling. There's Adam Warlock. Silver Surfer, Captain Marvel. Right here are X Force. And my favorite in the collection, Jim Lee X Men. I definitely need stands for Nightcrawler, Wolverine, and Rogue. So they could be in a better pose. Is X? I was gonna say X Force, X Factor, and I definitely need to pick up the rest of the Strong Guy way, but I'm in no rush. Here are the Avengers, and I need to stand for Iron Man as well. And here's the First Family, Fantastic Four. On this shelf are the villains. Here are the Sinister Six. I need a stand for Vulture and Mysterio and Green Goblin. And it's been years I've been trying to look for Rhino's left, not left, right arm and left leg. And here are the X-Men villains. And I hope Hasbro gives us an updated Toad, Blob, Strife. There's Sauron on a stand. I need a stand for Dark Phoenix as well. Maybe Magneto. And I forgot if, what's his name? Crap, I forgot his name. I think Shadow King. Let me know in the comments if that's his name and if he if he is a X-Men villain because I forgot. There's a Toy Biz Galactus. I hope Hasbro gives us an updated Fin Fang Foom. And let me know if the head sculpt goes well with Mr. Hyde's body. And I'll probably pick up two more AIM soldiers so I could pair up with Modoc. And this is a really dope fig. Let me just back up a little bit. And I don't even have space. 
button. There you go. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for the love and support as always. But more importantly, love you guys. All right, peace.